For me, the favourite's got to be Michael Clark. If you look at the runs he's scored, it's phenomenal, really. A phenomenal run of form, not just hundreds, but big hundreds, and the sort of hundreds that have changed the course of a match for his side. For me, the favourite, again, has got to be Michael Clark. His runs, I think he's head and shoulders above everyone else in terms of the runs he scored and the average in, in that period. Side Ajmal of Pakistan, uh, his ability to take wickets is such a crucial ingredient in winning uh, one-day internationals. Uh, the second guy that I think has had a phenomenal year in one-day cricket is MS Dhoni of India. Shateshwar Pujara really hit the ground running for India, playing brilliantly against England in that test series. The other guy from England, Joe Root, uh, played really, really well in both test cricket and one-day internationals in his first year. I think he's got a big future as well. For me, the man who deserves it more than any other is Ed Joy. For Umar Ghul, he's phenomenal, devastating spell of bowling against South Africa at Centurion. He's got five for six in 2.2 overs, an unbelievable performance. For me, Richard Kettlebra, uh, a young, ambitious umpire. Uh, his performance over the 12 months is phenomenal. He's head and shoulders above any other umpire in terms of the stats. Has to be MS Dhoni. He's probably a favourite every year, but uh, again, he's had a, a phenomenal year as, as India captain, leading from the front, both with the bat and uh, some really fine examples of, of positive, proactive captaincy. I always look for players that can make an impact, a match winning contribution, either as a bat or ball, and I think there's been plenty of those performances this year. Really, the, the fundamentals of the game. That's when they're able to be very consistent over a long period of time in all sorts of different conditions. I think bowlers that can keep making impact uh, with the new ball, with the old ball, uh, it's a very hard art to, to keep taking wickets consistently in Test cricket. So the bowlers that are able to do that definitely stand out.